for a while and I want my first video back to be a tribute to my best friend absolute best dog in the world I loved him so much loved him to bits and that's Hobson so I did Queen and you're my best friend okay so let's start a look uh, start by looking at the chords all right so we've got um, basically uh, electric piano here but I'm playing just an octave a C as I play that with the second finger of my right hand and my thumb, a lower octave, C, okay, I play one on the B string and three on the A string. And then I'm picking that C again and adding, still keeping that one to, or going all the way through, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Four. So we've got, yeah. So you got ba -da. So here I'm keeping that C going and playing C and then two one one on the G, B and E string. So I'm picking with three fingers on the right hand on the top three strings and picking that B string again playing that F chord again so I've got A, C and F there so we've got an an F over C there. And go to a C chord. Okay, so play C, F, and then C, F again. And then just shift your fingers so it's open, one, open. So we've got a C chord of that C. So we've got Okay, 
and that plays just on the intro and carries on through the verse okay that just keeps going round so just keep going around on that on um, the kind of intro it's kind of almost like a chorus it starts on okay but that first section anyway and then we go um, there we go again these are kind of played on the piano but I'm playing C G C G A minor okay and then a D that I ever had then F to G Same again, C, C, G, C, G, A minor, D, Yama, F, and G. So, to, so we've got uh, ba 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 So this the second time it climbs up, we've got F, G. E over G sharp, so play four, seven, six, four, five, four. It's basically the C shape moved up to four with um, a bar on four. Then it goes A minor, G, F, F minor, you're the best friend. Again, then back into that C octave. So we've got D, F, C, uh, F, G, C, A minor, D, F, G, E of G sharp, A minor, G, O, you know the best. And then you just basically play start just to kind of that F over C to begin with but then you go into this kind of bridge section so we're going uh, so we've got C E augmented so I'm playing seven six five five starting on the A string a minor, C7, and F, F minor, and then we've got G, rain or shine, to E7, ba, 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 you. A minor to D7, okay, so, ba, ba, ba. Um, then we've got a G6, so I'm playing three, five, D string gets muted for that E, the sixth note on five, and the G on three. To a G, you're my best friend. And then, and then I'm basically just repeating all of that. That's your chord sequence. And then you'll notice at the end, there's just a section where it goes from C to to F minor, you're my best friend. F minor, you're my best. And then a little bit of the first section, and then just right at the end, it ends by just repeatedly going G to C. So lovely chords, and a little tribute there to uh, just the loveliest of dogs, Hobson. And uh, anyway, uh, we'll take a little next at the lead parts. So we've got classic Brian May here where he's using multi-tracks to stack up the chord tones. So on a lower guitar I'm playing a D to a C, okay? And I did three parts, I think there's at least four on here, so you could double up with an extra, put an A and G underneath, put it on one guitar, just that part. So I'm playing seven and seven, five and five, or just single notes, whatever you want, on the D and G strings. And it gets these little fills in here. 
uh, just a C, slide to E, G, C, just C major chord. Okay, three, seven, five, five. Okay, and then a little extra note. D, slide to E, C again on five. That again, then. Again, I could double up or just play single notes. So just play five seven, or then bend it on that D to an E. And then on top of that, you've got a, uh, you basically take this one next. F to E, ten to nine. Any that extra note this time a G to nine, okay, and then just going up the neck C D E, okay, 13, 15, bent to 17, and then a higher one, got A to a G, so. to B here, so 10, 8, 10, 12, 8, 10, last one, playing 12, 13, bend into that G, so 12, 13, bend a tone. And when you put all those together, it sounds like classic Queen, okay. For the next section on the main guitar, I'm starting with just a C, G and A, so I'm repeating, so 5 and then 5 and 7 on the G and D strings, and over that you've got another guitar playing, um, uh, so pinching a harmonic, so playing 10 on the uh, G string and F with a bend to G, release and bend back up. Okay, so that's over that as an overdub. And then going back to the main guitar, so we've got. Uh, so play this C. Um, so. So I'm bending a, a, a D, up and release, so 7 bend, release, then C, E, G, C, 3, 7, 5, 3, on A and D. And then I'm repeating that. repeating so it's all three and seven on a five and five on D and G and then we've got a little kind of blue scale just bend and release on seven on the G string D pull off to five seven five then we've got ba -da, ba -da, ba -da, ba -da. So I'm playing D, E Okay, and then going C, D, E And then just Kind of just kind of Just like wiggling that and releasing it So basically you're playing F sharp And we're just going to fast kind of It's almost like a trumpet with a little kind of uh, a little wiggle on that. Okay, and so that's one guitar, and the other one is coming in with so uh, you kind of playing the 
little couple of little bends around the A blues scale. Okay, just Okay, just kind of repeating at seven, five, seven, and then a little bend. Okay, on E, e flat, F E flat on eight. Okay, and then playing the harmony with this one. We've got G, G sharp. So these are chord tones with the chords we're playing. So we've got the root of the G chord, the third of the E7 chord. And again, you're going up. And just and kind of wiggle. Okay, so we're playing A, B, C, D and just wiggling that on so 10, 12, 13, 15 bend and then just on that last section as well I've got and then um, we've got I'm playing A B B C D E D. Okay, so seven four um, and then five seven nine seven. Okay, so again, great little solo there. And next, we'll take a look at the outro section. On the outro, we're going from a C to an F minor. So we'll start with a C chord tone. 13 on the B string and then so I'm, I'm bending a, a minor third up to that C releasing so bending on 10 up to 13 G F E F so 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 Okay, so we've got 10, 8, 10, 9, 10. Okay, and that's one guitar. And then the other one, I'm playing a G. Okay, on 8 on the B string, and then we've got a bending a, a tone here. Release, F, so F to G, then F, E, D, C, C, and going to a D there, so we're kind of getting an F minor 6 chord with that D in it. So 6, 5, 7, 5, 5, 7. On the third part, I'm playing. So just um, starting on E, on 9, on the G string, then bend in D, release on 7, C on 5, just 3 Gs da, 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 to A flat, 5 to 6, okay, and then we're just going, when we hit, just hold that, then back to the G. Go back to the A flat, the F minor chord, and same with the guitar, you can go. Uh, so, um, you can go to that C for that F chord, back to the E for the C. So, just you'll see on the playthrough that it's just basically hitting chord tones of the C major and F minor, and then you've got a little one of those again. You see that on the playthrough, and then we're just finishing off with some harmony because you're going from G to C. So you've got one guitar playing B to C, one guitar playing D to E, okay, the other guitar just playing a G. So again, put those three together, you've got basically a, a G to a C chord, and 
What a great kind of way of layering the guitars up that is. Classic Brian May. So next we'll take a look at the bass. I'm starting the bass on a C and all the kind of first section bass lines are based around a C and a C scale. We've got playing C, A, G, F, E, F, G, C. So eight on E, seven on D, 10, 8, 7, back up, 8, 10, back to the root, C, and then, so sometimes we go down to the C, and sometimes to the C an octave higher, so I've got, I'm playing a little chromatic passing note here, D, E, F, A, E, then G, A, C, so, yeah, so we've got, Seven, eight, nine on the G string, and ten, seven, ten, and then little playing just uh, G A C A G C. They're all quite similar. These, so you could kind of interchange them a bit, you know, as long as you're kind of hitting those C notes. Uh, so, and he kind of keeps going back to that one. A slightly simpler one there, just A, G, C, 7, 10, 8. Back to that. Sometimes you get an extra note in there, so instead of starting on that G on 10, you start by an extra A. Again, it doesn't really matter if you play that or. So you've got one, two, three, one, two, three, four. So A, G, A, C, A, G, C. So seven, ten, seven, ten, seven, ten on D and A. Down to C. Just that again. And, and that. So it's all around that C scale. Okay. So you've got eight. You don't use that D in this, but basically the C major scale is. 8, 10, 7, 8, 10, and then 7, we don't play the B in this bit, but it's in the scale, 9, 10, and then carrying up, you've got the D, you've got a chromatic passing note that you get, you get there, E, okay, so it's all about mostly those notes, okay, and then, so we've got, and then we're going into the next section, so we've got, so we've got C, E, G, C, B, A, okay, so again, all, that C major scale, 8, 7, 10, on E and A, then 10, 9, 7, you have the best, then B, C, D, 9, 10, 12, then I have a Then we just go F, G with a slide down to 10, 12 on the G string, and then back to that again, and that again, then. So this time we carry on going up. F, G, 10, 12, G sharp, 13, and I've got over an A minor chord, A to C, so 14 to 17. They've got a G chord, so I'm playing two G chord tones, B, G, B. Okay, so we've got 16, 17, 16. And we hit an F chord, F major, playing F there on 15 on the D string, then jumping down to a low F, I think it is, or that one would work, but I take that low note on one, boom. And then I should hit that F minor. Ooh, you're my best friend. And there's a little fill, nice little F minor fill there. Just play an F minor chord tone, C, A flat, and F. So just pulling off on um, 17. 13, 15, on G and D, 
and then landing on that C. Okay, you're my best friend. There's a little break, the intro, and then. So I play that first. Oh. I play the, the C again. So I played the first one. Although, any one of those would fit, because they're all based around that C chord. Uh, and then, so. So here I'm playing C, and then jump into G sharp, A, A sharp. So I'm playing eight, then on the D string, six, seven, eight. And then we've got an F chord, so I'm playing F. So I'll play F, and then slide it up to a C, an F, 15, 15, on A and D, back to F. And then rain or shine, D. And so we've got happy at home. So here we've got a nice little chromatic. So play G D twelve twelve. Then twelve eleven ten nine. Little chromatic passing note. Get it from a G to an E. And just D E. Then A, C, D, and so A, sorry, B, C to D. Okay, so we've got from an A minor chord to a D chord. 7, 9, 10, 12. Then it's going down the scale to a G, C, B, A, G. It actually, happy at home. You're my best friend. And then to a C, so I'm playing 10, 9, 12, 10, 10, boom. And then I'm basically uh, repeating, okay? And then second time around, I did a few extra bits. So I'm going, um, That's the same. We got so here we've got some extra bits thrown in. So I'm playing. That's the same. Boom, bam, 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 bam. So I'm throwing in now A, B, C, E, D. And then, so I'm going 7, 9, 10, 14, 12. Then put F sharp, G, A. So 11, 12, 14. So. Then F, G, like before, G sharp. That's like before. Boom. Best way again, then so that's the same boom bam. over the solo this time, under the solo, I should say, and then so here it's a little more complicated than before. I'm still in that F going up to C and F, then. Putting a little fill in here, which I think is so. I've got I'm playing an F on 13 on the E string and one, two, so one, two, da, da, da. so I'm playing F A flat on 13 on the G string. Then I'm just a little kind of a kind of little blue scale one, so 17, 15, 13. 30, uh, 15, 13, 15 on G and D. Then a slight variation on before I'm playing. So this time just, I'm not playing, not playing that, I'm just playing. Da, 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 da. So G, F sharp, F, E. So 
12, 11, 9, 10, uh, so 12, 11, 10, 9. And B, E, D, B. Nine, nine, seven, nine. And that's just like before, seven, nine, ten, twelve, then da 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 oh, you're my best friend. Okay, and uh, then we've got one, two, three, four, one. Got a little section here at the end where it goes a couple of times to C to, to F minor, so one, two, three, four, one. So I've got these couple of little fills up the neck, so I'm playing D, uh, then E for A, 12, 13, 14, and 12, 14, 17, G, A, C, then an F on 15, hitting an F, C, back to 8, then going back, just going up the C scale to the F. Okay, boom, ba 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 ba. So, eight, ten, nine, eight. Back to C. And then again, another little fill here. Kind of similar. Ba 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 ba. So I'll just play. Same notes going up, but now coming back down, same notes to that E. So, 14, 12, 14. There, and you've got another one. A little, and boom, ba Another little fill there. It's all around this same C scale, but the neck, 17. Little chromatic one. Uh, just going 14, 13, 12, 14, 13, 12. Okay, little fills like that. And so that's just over that end section. And then you've got um, just got a little bit where it goes G, B, C. And the same octave higher. So 3, 2, 3 on E and A. 10, 9, 10, A and D, back to that. They're carrying up, up the chord tones. So we've got C, E, G, 2, 5. And final three notes, we've got C, D, E. So we finish on not the root, but the third. 10, 12, 14. Okay, so it's a great bass part. You can have a lot of fun playing about with that, all those little fills, which you can kind of leave out or put in. It all works. And uh, what a great song. And as I mentioned, a little tribute there to our bestest buddy, the best friend anyone could have, Mr. Hobson. Uh, just a message, if ever you ever find yourself in a situation where you can adopt a senior doggy, um, and do so because um, they're just amazing and brilliant and they'll give you so much love. So uh, this one's for Hobson and uh, thanks for watching. Cheers.